Hello, Sherman. Welcome back to the Leon Smith player career mode. In the last episode, we started off going against Kim Rock, where we had a very stale game to start off the episode, only getting the nil-nil right there. Both teams were at it, but there's just no goals, and it finished goalless. Going to the second game now, we went against St. Johnston, where finally we got some goals in that game. It was a 2-0 win with Leon Smith finally getting his first goal in the last episode. However, when we get into the final game though, against Ross County, my god, it was a demolition derby where we won 6 0 with Leon Smith picking up a hat trick to finish off the episode. Which leads us now against St. Mirren in our first game at Celtic Park 46 versus 18 points right there. As you can see, we've only got one loss there, but Hearts, Rangers, and Aberdeen are up our asses. So we definitely need to get a couple of wins here and get a bit more fur up front in the table. Before we advance and have a look at the lineups that Big Brendan Johnson is putting out today, we have got a bit of player growth right here. I don't know what to put it on here. This is the problem. I'm not too sure. I feel like it's long shot and power shot. I feel like we get that one there, get a little bit higher right there. But we have got plus one. However, I might try and save that one. How do I know? I think we do just use it now. Do we use it on the dribbling? Ball control definitely needs a little bit of work there, so we'll get that up as well. Have I got up at all? I think we've gone to an 81. You can also see as well, Leon Smith, his uh, beard has grown out. He's actually got a bit of hair now. So the bold man, aka the Rain Rooney kind of vibe, is gone now. However, let's advance a couple of days here. They've got a long way to go here. So let's just have a look. Hurry up. A little bit stalling now. The rails are so far away. Looks so like we're earning a bit of money on the side. But we are dropping down in the top left-hand corner because we're not turning up to training. Which we will do now. Let's get a bit of training going on. Let's load that up. Boom, there we go. Confirmed back in the star next side. And let's have a look at the lineups that big Brendan Rogers is putting out today. So let's say my main man Turnbull and Medina and Neen. Absolute domination dub against Ross County, them four. Well, including myself, we're speaking to myself in the third part. If for some reason it is on world class, I'll quickly change that. That is very strange indeed. Get that back onto play legendary. What are you bloody playing at right there? I'll tell you what, I'm feeling a bit tasty today. Let's go for a bit of competition and player bounce as well. Let's just get a bit of that involved. Why the hell not? Oh, anyway, going back to the last zone, the Roski or Wasser Fincher. Let's take our strongest team with Ramirez in goal as well. Partly clear skies on legendary. Confirmed now. Jesus Christ, I don't know why that's changed. Let's get into this. So here we are then. There's myself speaking to the team. However, what is our objectives for today? Let's have a look at it. Match rating of at least nine points. Avoid losing the match and take three shots on target. I reckon we can definitely do that. We should be getting the winner today. Let's see what happens. Radio, so no more bold Leon Smith. He's got a bit of stub up the top of the head now, so uh, why the hell not? And I'm not looking to play shaver. We want to get back to that ponytail vibe, as we all loved. O'Hara on the ball here. This strand. See what they're going to do on this play here. Fraser. All right, come on then, boys. Let's, uh, let's wake up a little. Let's get involved in some challenges. I know it's only been five minutes, but they've been just set on this left side quite a bit now. Work on better timing. All right, okay. I need to start looking a bit more up here. Deeper, deep, deep. But they're running through here. There's a roulette there. Someone needs to turn up here. One from the Roski. Okay, inside there. For myself. They turn there from Smith. With a bit of a switcher, and then we're just going to relax on the play a bit and work this ball up, I think. Hmm, just keeping possession still, really. Nothing's really opening up. Now we get into Turnbull. Our Kevin DeBorn and the team. There's a ball at the top there. If you could quickly find it, but we just cannot. Kind of get it down there. Fair play to their defence. Keeping it strong at the back. Just waiting for an opportunity. I mean, 20 minutes in now. Finally, they messed up there a little bit. Let's say a little bit of a run there. Can we get that pass over the cross? We can. So quiet. It's terrible on the ball. What's he going to do? He's kind of fumbled it there. But it's still alive. Good turn there from Smith. Oh, I can't get them one last turn. I was going to release the cracking right there. Also, we need a lot of shots on target. We need three this game. But we need a quite a lot anyway. To see if we can get some manual in real life. Which they are picking some form up. I mean, rush by Hoyland now. He's kind of hitting some form. It's nice to finally see. There's a ball over the top potentially. But this wasn't really distributed the best. Can we get it back? We can't. We've just fell on our ass really. Fair enough. A battle on the ball here. Gives it grease. We should be able to get that there. And now, can we get something going on this? Let's go for a bit short hit. Alright, for some reason he's done that. Alright, okay. It's worked out. Just got to keep possession. Be patient. Wait for the gaps to open up here. It's not the best. It should be, I was going to say, wasn't going to the player there. The ball over the top, but potentially you can get it over. We kind of are getting him over, but I must say, Medea on the right mid, he's not having the best game. He can't really put the balls over the top. There are gaps there. That's twice that's happened now, that gap. And he's not hit it perfectly. But Greer's in. Number 21 has got past the gap there, and our left centre back and left back plays it back into Abado. Abado just being patient there, and there we go. Pushing half time now. There's a Bit of a gap down the middle here. 
Oh, and the ref was just about playing LB wide to Medina there on number 38, I do believe, in the bottom right corner. But Nuno at the break, I don't know what to really think of it. I think we had this in the last episode of the first game. It was very really stale, but in the second half, it kind of got a bit of, bit more momentum from both teams. We've seen for the match rate 5.8, but I'm not really getting any chances of the problem. Avoid losing the match, and we need some shots on target. Radio, second half has begun. I believe there's no changes from Brendan Rodgers. So he's just kind of relying on what's kind of happening at the moment, and it's been a bit stale. But there's a ball out wide there, but it's gone to the wrong player. I want it to Neen, but it's gone to the overlap and Rome, which I don't really want. Because, well, you look at it now, he's way of position. He's playing like a bloody camera. He's finally gone back to his original position, the left back, I do believe. Tans has actually beaten Medina, but Medina has won it back. The player, a wide sloppy pass there from Leon Smith. As I said, we've seen it in this last episode. Not really been hit in form. Been very, very strange, but I suppose we've just got to keep going and wait for our chance to rise. We've got an ultra attacker now. Brent Rogers is obviously not as satisfied with what's going on so far. Abado, well done. Defense is doing well. Just got to go to the left there. All right, these two are just playing with each other. Fair enough. Inside. There's an overlapping run there. Can we get it in? There's a good ball from Leon Smith, but he goes to get it. Johnson does get it. Goes for the shot. That great save from St. Cullen there. A pass was good, but it wasn't amazing. But it did work out in the end. Got to go outside the box here. Good touch from Smith. Got a lot of room for finesse here. And we could get the second. Someone shoot, and we do. And it's Medina, I believe, to Zen Medina, where his bloody name is. We've got the goal. We'll take it. Because this game has been very strange indeed. We're just nothing's really hitting us. And we finally break the deadlock right there. Well done. Decent finish. Pounce like a panther. There's a bit of a poacher's kind of strike and move that. But our right mid doing our job there. We went for the shot. It's a shot on target, which we'll take. And well, Medina was already there for pounce and he pits it in. Well done. We won him up. So the two should be made here. Let's see what's going off there. I don't know who that is. I can't tell. We well, should be able to see in the top left hand corner in a minute after this little cutscene goes of who have just scored and the scores so far. I don't know if it's going to pop up or not. So we're very intrigued. Oh, here we go. Attack has come on for Kwan. All right, fair enough. We'll take it. Back us on the ball. Who and I'll be here to just get some of the players to press. Abado, I'm sitting on the last man. Well done. Getting the ball back here. Bit of a counter attack perhaps going on now. Terrible. There is a switch. Just going to call for it. There we go. Come short then. Oh, I need unbelievable. Oh, so lucky that. If he got that there, I could have been, uh, well, potentially on the overlap. 72 minutes in now, though. There's a risk of me getting subbed off. I don't think I've done too bad this game. I was involved in the goal. Obviously, uh, well, they're not very satisfied at the moment. My pass has been very sloppy. Maybe something I need to work on. I don't know. Ramirez, don't fumble this, my man. Well done. Does well. Defence is doing really well today, I've got to say. It's a little ball over the top if you want to hit it. Very cheeky there. The ball there. And again. Leon Smith under pressure. We're going to get the overlapping run there from Medea. I'm inside again if you want it. There it is. Going to go for the shot. That was a great shot goal. Probably should have hit it on the better foot though on the angle. Do we go for it again? We got a goal for me doing it last time. Pretty much. So we go here. The back post on the back post. There's a great ball on the back post. And the battle does well. Bit of a threat. There's a bit of a tactic here just hitting it to me short and then let me do what I need to do with the ball. Good touchdown there from Leon Smith. We've seen it at the angle way before, but it's just way too much. Keep trying. So the manager's satisfied with my attempt. I've hit way too much power. We'll see it again here on the left peg. Got to keep that down. Wasn't the best there. And video 85 minutes in now. And I feel like we're just going to get the 1 0 result. Unless we're just going to get maybe one last attempt. It's a ball over the top there, but I will just hit down the line. Uh, that's all right. Still alive. It's a ball there to Turnbull. Something could happen here. We could get a second goal. Hasper Lolic needs an option. Can we get it with a steal? We can. And I think... Oh, hang on just a second. If he gets that win... No, maybe not. I think that's going to be where it is, ladies and gentlemen. This ref should blow it now. Any time now, ref. Oh, God. I don't know if we'll get this. Well done there from a wire. Crucial challenge right at the end. And that'll be it for the first game of the Celtic against St. Mary and Gentlemen, Medina there getting the goal off the my deflection shot. And we will take it. We will take it. I mean, I didn't have a bad game. I think I finished on like a 7.2, maybe 6.9. I'm not too sure. But like I said, we'll take the result. It's a win-win. It's a That's all I've got to say. The team comes first. We got shots on target, which is ideal to hit our objectives near the end of the season. That was one of the main calls from last episode. 7.3. So I feel like I've had a good game. Two shots on target. We avoided the loss. We got the win. 
I'll take it. We we'll continue on. Right, let's jump on to the next game, and it's a biggie. It is a biggie indeed. It is Aberdeen. Where are they in the league? It is first versus fourth. This is a game we need to win because this is one of the teams that has right up our ass. Unless we're going with exactly the same team, unless it seems like Fincher and Hawan has changed positions from LDM to RDM. They've kind of switched positions around. Let's see if, correct me if I'm wrong, we got a new sign in left back in Padriza. I don't know if that's a new one there, but 79 overall left back. Very well done indeed from so Make a good a bit of business now. Could be completely wrong. But it seems like it. You never know though. Maybe it's just me. Let's get into this. So here we have it then. Back at Celtic Park against Aberdeen. It is first versus fifth. Interesting one indeed. Hopefully we can put on a bit of display at, at Celtic Park. And then hopes I can come with a win. Look at the objective style though. 8.5. Take three shots. Style, same as last one. Pretty much deja vu. But I believe the only change is the 8.5. That's the only difference right there. I believe it was 9 in the last one. But... Let's see if we can do it. Let's do this. Here we have it then. Soic are back. So let's see if we can do it with my good mate Turnbull. as my Kevin De Bruyne. He needs to assist me a bit more here. I hope we can do it right. Typical there, Neil Smith. Neil loses possession. That's one of his weak spots, I think. He loses possession quite poorly for his team. Neil Smith trying to bounce past there. Thanks to bloody Cristiano Ronaldo. Look for another option. But Medina has won it back there, which is ideal. That's right. Just play it safe. We don't need to rush this. So one more there. Could go for the shot there. It's a good shot. It's a good save from Ross. Good shot. They got the shot on target. Do I go for the tactic once again? I think we've got to do it. Going inside the box there. I'm going to go for the volley. Why not? It's a good volley. A goal, but it's a great block, to be fair. And now Duke could go on a bit of a run here for my very silly choice of going for a bit of a Zinedine Sedan volley outside the box. Keeps running here. Plays the back. Oh, wow, that's a brilliant game. He's been so good. In this last game and uh, well this game as well to so switch on there it's a good switch from leon smith just regroup with the team and hopefully we can get a couple of goals good switch there Podraza plays it over the top there to leon smith needs an option try to do well there but just couldn't get involved as you can see their best offensive team in the league 22 games played and only 15 goals against which is pretty good for Sirk, i must say we really are there's a reason why we've only lost one game this season Got to be going for the title. That's the reason why we came here to finally get some silver and then if Leon Swiss's career. Good pass there, but once again, it's a Watter that gets the interception. Fincher and wide open, way too long. No switch there. No need to rush. Into Johnston. Good ball down the line. Medina going to pull back. So I know you don't really like crossing the ball half the time. Good turn there. Turnbull could be through there. Oh, we just need a bit more power. And we would have been the Kevin Boys there having the eye of the eagle there. Try and just pin the needle through that defensive line. But we just couldn't get in there. McGareth running through here. The man with the green boots. All right, so two on one there, boys. Someone put his leg in. That's the reason why he's got the green little triangle above his head. Someone hit him. It's a good turn there from number 55. Gives it into Shinny. Number four. Someone hit him. Well, a good block there, but still alive with Clarkson. Number 10. Pulls it back to Duke. Awasa again. Could be the man of match so far. Gonna call for it here. Why not? Leon Smith. Good strive through the middle here. Why not? Switch is completely wide open for Medina. Terrible touch though. Terrible touch. Approaching the half time already. And well, I mean the ball already hasn't really gone out. This game series has gone so quick. We got it there. Come on. So we got a lot of bodies forward here. It's a three on four pretty much. Inside again. Ah. Our wingers have been poor. Our wingers have been poor. I must say they've not been the best this game. He's been dreadful. Turnbull. One more. Oh, you have your camp blow there. Could potentially ran through and scored, but it is what it is, I suppose. Again, same with the last game. Nothing really has happened in the first half. I mean, we've got a bit of a spell where we're turning to a bit of a second hand, well, half team, sorry. Match objectives are not looking good as well. They're quite bleak. Here we are then. Aberdeen kicking off the second half. And once again, no changes. Oh, it's Celtic from Brendan Rodgers. Interesting one indeed. Thought he would at least try and make one from, like we said, the last game. Kind of let where it worked, but we got very lucky. It was a deflected goal, really, so... Well, not deflected, but a rebound goal. Let's just say that there. Magar plays it to Duke, and it's 1-0 to Aberdeen. Now, we got to wake up, because, uh, well, Duke there, number 11. This is a huge result here for them if they get this, and we cannot avoid a draw. Or a loss. It's so tight in the table. Ramirez should be doing better on this near post. You don't get being in your near post. That's the golden rule of being a goalkeeper. 
And he has done there. But defence, sloppy in the second half. Rogers is fuming. I don't blame him. All right, come on. We need to wake up here now because this is a bit poor from Sewick. Need to get some goals here. Dezine, I could be through straight away. But again, I know I pressed wise there. But I must say, I mean, it's been very poor. Very poor from the attack. And oh, well, man, so I mean, you can't just attack the AI. Maybe my runs are not being more clinical. But it's just simple, silly things. Like the switch we did in the first half to Medina. The heavy touches. It's poor. Very poor. Fincher, I could be through. Could get that. I am going to get that with Leon Smith. Can we cut in cyber hats? Is there any options? There is an option, but they're all running away from the ball. Very annoying. McDonald on the ball here. We could try and close him, but he's turned me silly. Should be winning that there. Come on, lads. All we need is a chance. All we need is a chance, and we'll get the momentum then to just go for something. Pass there. No, 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 no. All right, somehow it still worked. Good turn there. Into Turnbull. Got a bit of space to go into, man. Overlapping run. There's a ball in the middle. Can he get it to me? It's a terrible ball. Needs to be a lot higher there for me to contest for that. Still alive there. How have they got away with that? I do not know. Have we got it back there? Could get something now. I might go on my own here. Leon Smith. Oh, I should have maybe sweared it. I think I should have sweared it there. But I have to go for it. I had to go for it. It's just one of them. Santos. Gonna be really bad on stamina, mate. Risk of getting subbed off. I don't blame Brendan Rogers. I've been poor. The whole attack's been so it's just not been their day today. It's not been good at all. Good head back there. Kawan, what are you doing? That's what I mean by the heavy touches. It just isn't one of them today. Goes out wide. Not good. Inguada. Trying to do something here. Can't do it. Gonna sit on the last man now. We're all, we're all forward. Just get the ball up the top. No, stop playing the defence. That's it. Need an option here. Come on. We'll try and concentrate a bit now. Gotta work it inside, lads. That's it. Nice play. Nice there. Oh, terrible. It's just not our day. Not our day today. Which I do believe our last game of this episode is the old firm. And I believe last time. I was injured, so I couldn't play it. And, uh, well, if we go into it like this, it's not good. Look at this guy. He's wasting time. Play playing other team. Oh, a rat. Fair play to them, though. Aberdeen have got the win today at Selwick Park. A lot of whistles and a lot of boos from our home fans, and I don't blame them. It's our second loss, and that was a hard pool to swallow. It's safe to say, like I said, if we play like that, against Rangers in our next game and our final game of this episode it's not going to be good a lot of disappointment there from Leon Smith as you can see the head of the shake it's just one of them not good so here we have it then it is Rangers versus Sewick at the Ibrox Stadium as you can see Rangers have gone top and we've dropped down the second with Aberdeen in third now after our defeat against them right there we need to win this to finish this table well episode sorry first in the table that's what I was trying to refer to right there I'm a bit optimistic now. I don't know, really know what to expect. Looks like we're going with the exactly the same team here. Got to play better though. Just got to get into this and hopefully give Rangers a run for the money. So here it is. Uh, Rangers versus Surrey. I can't remember the last time we played these. Obviously, I was injured, but I can't remember the result. I believe, I think we won, I believe. So we could make it 2-0 against them. It's the biggest rivalry in football, in my opinion. Let's do this. So come on then. Let's finish on a high here, because we've not had the episode, have we, today? It's not been good at all. We need a win, and they could finish against Rangers. You never know. Got to go for it now. Need to sell it, like we did in the last hour where we won against Ross County 6-0. That's what we need. And, uh, well, with switches like that, very poor for me, but ideally we won it back when Oroski. Inside there. Every little triangle. Again, that's, that's two field passes from Leon Smith. I think, to be fair, Jesus, that is a... We're back past the Butland there, but fair enough. I think we need to work on our passing. I think that's the next upgrades we need to just completely just hit, really. Because we can't make a two-yard pass at the moment. Good switch there, though. Very strange one so far. We get a ball through there. I don't know what happened there. I mean, we played the ball. Is that going to be a corner kick? And it will be a corner kick. I did think it will be. We've got a ball outside the box there. Not going to get it, though. But it's going to be cleared towards me. we we'll get a pass off there. What is going on? Campbell does well. And there will be still a Celtic throw-in. Good pass there. 
A good ball there. Goes into Smith. Goes for the shot there. Jack Butland there. The former Premier League goalkeeper does really well. And Isaac keeps possession here. Can we get it back on? Oh, thought we had it there. Well, uh, well, 20 minutes. Let's just say that. Isaac running through here. Rangers, the needle there. Going for the shot now. Ramirez has to force the save. Right, we're on the last man. Just going to quickly show you there. We're on the left-hand side. But the short option has been played. Turnbull, you've got to get to him, man. That is your man. You need to mark. It's going in there. Can we get it out now? I'm trying to call for it so it can maybe hit us. Golson on the ball here. The captain plays in Danilo. Plays it into Aja. Goes for the shot now. Ramirez has to force another save for a Rangers at corner. The Ibrox Stadium. The home side looking like the better team so far. Wooden from Neen. Good block. Come on. Stay in their possession. It's kind of what happened really with our first attempt really. Gone through spells where, well, this is the old firm. What do you expect? You never know what's going to happen. We're going to do so. I don't really want to do it defensive work. It's so hard not to trap back and help what they're doing to get this ball back. But sometimes you have just got to rely on the AI to get the challenges in. It's a good ball. That's a fantastic to Lama. It's a good save again. Three saves and no from Ramirez. Their defence really needs to wake up here. Not being good at all. Haji. All right, they should be getting that one there. Now we're going to get it with Leon Smith. Can the megastar run all the way through here? He needs a goal this episode. Trying to run through. Stepper with City. We're going to keep going, but he does really well. He just sticks out to our four. I beat him. He just gets away with it. Unlucky there from Smith. Oh, he's right here. Got a bit of gap in the middle. We should be getting that one there. Well done from Johnston. I could be potentially through here. The defence is all over the gaff. Absolutely over the gaff. There's a switch on there. We're going to get it to Neen. Neen run through all the way. Someone here with a shot there and he's got it. We told him to shoot and he has got the goal. And we have got another assist. We will take it. We might not be scoring in this episode today, but we put it on a plate for Neen there. I thought he was going to butcher it. Hence why I just told him to bloody shoot. Rangers are fuming the whistles. And it looks like Soic are on their way to potentially winning this old firm rivalry right here. The keeper's got to do better there. Jack Butland, that is poor from you. But well done to Neen. So 43 minutes in, and we have got the goal. Happy days. Just come from nothing. I mean, I don't know where the defence went, to be fair, with Rangers. It was a very strange one to really assess. But this Arjo is getting a lot of the ball here. And he's played a decent ball down the line. But unfortunately, it does go out for a throw-in. Which means we go into the second half 1-0 up. The away team getting a bit of fight back in their bellies now. I'd like to see Leon Smith have one assist here today, but no goals yet. Need to get some goals as a striker. A lot of whistles. And we all know... That is coming from Rangers. Radio, second half has begun. We've only got the one goal in it with Neen in the 43rd minute. But into the second half, no changes so far. Again, very strange. I expect maybe a one or two to be against his old firm. You've got to be very strategic going against any of your roles in football. And, uh, well, he has not done it so far. But, however, it, whatever he is doing is working because we are 1-0 up. Hadji on the ball here. But it's to Cantwell. Cantwell looking to do something... Now, the former Norris man plays to Lammers. Great save again from Ramirez. The man of the match by far. That was our best chance. And it's a decent save. We're going to peel it to the right there. Because we had our best chance when we was on the wings like this. And again, goes up for another corner. I don't know how many corners have had now. But by five or six, it's got to be now for Rangers. Two in the second half. Goes short here, Haji. Went to the box there. It's going in. Good win. Oh, Godson, sorry. It's one all. It is the captain. And now this old rivalry has really woken up now. The home side in Rangers. It finally happened one of these corners. And the defence got exposed. And it's a great header from the captain. You can't blame Ramirez. You've got to blame the defence on this one. Shocking. I feel bad for our keeper. A great header there. Annoying. Got to get it back now. Right here. Come on then, lads. Got to get something here. It's the ball down line, to be fair. I'm going to get there. Good uh, peel out there from... Good skill there. Unbelievable. I'm going to do I was going to say. Put it back if you want to. Oh, one more. Too many times. Too many times there. Golson there. The goal's going to do really well. We're going to go outside again. Can we get it there? Ah, oh, God's sakes. Golson, go away. Good get him here. Good pressure. It's so hard sometimes to just do that set piece because sometimes you get obstructed by defenders, but they've panicked there. And that should be ours. Ideal. Oh, good pressure there from Celtic. Come on. We can't really end this on a draw because it just gives Aberdeen the advantage and to get up the table as well. But um, one more there. I didn't want it there. God's sake. It's not been my day, lads. I just, I don't know. I don't know what is happening here today. Leon Smith's had a bit of a mare. 
Let's say Saliba's gone to Newcastle. That's a bit of a wild transfer right there. Very strange indeed. Raskin. It's a good ball. We should be getting that one there with Naroski. Well done. Come on, there's a switch on. Oh, that's terrible. Jesus Christ. I ain't going to lie. I'll just spam the x button there just to get it out. Have we not got that there? I thought they had it there. 73 minutes in now, though. Come on, there's got to be a chance in this game. There's got to be a winner. Either it's Rangers or Celtic. Who knows? Come on. Good pass there. Augustusson. Trying to just help out now. I mean, we don't show any desire or integrity to go for it here. But Rangers are... Running from Johnston. Heavy touch though again. This horrible. Right, we could get something here. Turnbull, make the gap in there. Get the pass off. We do get it off and it's Turnbull. Turnbull, you could win it here. There's an overlapping run. I'm through. Oh, Neen again. This is what I'm saying. Oh, it's one simple pass through the gap. And now it could have bit us in the ass. That was the chance. And now Cantwell could go through and win the game. And he does. Well, that's just great. The guy that got us the goal in the first half cannot make a simple pass through that gap. And because of it, Rangers looks like they're going to win this. Oh, for God's sakes. It's a simple ball. I don't care what anyone says. He's got to get that pass off. And because of it, Campbell's gone on and scored. That's it. Take him off. Because, uh, well, he's cost us, in my opinion. We could have gone on and got the win. But, well... I don't know. And now Fincher's at a mare. Not good at all. Not good at all. Well in there from Leon Smith. Showing some desire there. Medine. Terrible. I don't know which way he's going to run. I prayed a wide boy into him. It's gone to his feet. But he's either running left or he's running right. It's nothing's happened there. Dessers plays it back to Raskin. Come on. One last chance here. Down the line. Oh, it ran off. That just sums it up, doesn't it? We're through on goal. And the ref blows it there. I think that just sums up this episode here today, ladies and gentlemen. Soek are in at the, uh, well, the doghouse. It's not been good at all. And, uh, well, the old rivalry is now one or a piece, I do believe. I'll do some research to see what that last result was. But terrible from Leon Smith. We got an assist. Well, actually, no, you know what? I didn't do too bad. I got an assist for the team. And just sloppy mistakes cost us that one. Annoying. So there it is, ladies and gentlemen. That is going to wrap up this episode here today. I mean, what a dreadful episode this has been, I must say. It just hasn't been well at all in terms of how we have played today. We've got the loss against Rangers, loss against Aberdeen. We did get the win against St. Merrin with that well, rebound goal with Medina. But other than that, I feel like we're playing good football. But we just can't do the simple and basics right. We can't do the two-yard passes. We've seen it. We can't do it with the previous with Ross County with that 6 0 win. But because of it now, that's back-to-back -back losses. And, well, we went from first to third now. And that's not good at all. Really need to bounce back in the next episode. And so does Leon Smith. Very, very bad indeed. But if you did like this video today, ladies and gentlemen, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.